Hi there, this is Jamie Swift here from Swift Furniture, Sliding Wardrobes. Um, today I'm just walking the upstairs of a dormer house. Uh, in most cases in a dormer, you have a big floor space in the bedroom. But with the slope ceilings, you can restrict the way you can actually put a wardrobe. You have lots of dead space and a wasted space. So what we decided to do here was we've opened up this stud partition in sections. What you usually have here is a stud, studded wall with a small trap door leading into the attic space. It's a good space to have but it's very, very unpractical to use. So we've, we've opened it up and we decided to put the wardrobe right back into the eaves of the roof. You know, the eaves run the entire length of the whole house. So here we have the, the massive bedroom is here. Just show you the section in the, the landing area. So the couple of units here are waiting to be fitted. And then in the end bedroom as well then. So in this case we have the, all the units fitted in the wardrobe here. Now obviously we're, we're restricted for height here. So the idea is to use the, to maximise the depth. As you can see, the carpets do go back quite far. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how we utilise that space with drawers, some shelving, and some hanging rails. And we make good use of the whole run of the entire house. So now we're at the stage where all the carcasses are fitting into place. They're all fitted out. In the first carcass, we have for three deep drawers and your storage shelf at the top. So there's a drawers come out, all with a solid base. In the next drawer, go for the short rail, some storage at the back, and drawer for shoes. In the next one where the water tank was, we've uh, built around the water tank, put a TV on top, some storage at the top for our skybox, NTL. Um, in here then, obviously it allows access to the water tank if needs be. Into the third, four carcass, we have our standard length rail and some shelving at the back. And in the last one again then your standard length rail. And we've still allowed access to this trap door to the remaining spaces in behind. Some storage. Now I'll just show you the landing area and the kids bedrooms. So now we're at the stage where all the doors are fitted. Um, in this case, it comes about for a pearl white door with a dark walnut band and a dark walnut surround. It ties in with the existing furniture. Um, in the next one, I'll show you the landing area and then in the kids' room as well. In the landing area, it's the same as the bedroom, pearl white with a dark walnut. And then in the, in the kids' room, because the rest of the room is pink, it's bright, it's a little girl's room, we for the white glass doors with a pink band just to break it going through this down, down off the centre. So again, we're walking in a similar type house here. Uh, again, we're walking into that awkward space. What you have in the first count is a long rail at the front. Standard rail at the back. In the second carcass are standard rail, some cubby hole shelves at the back for storage. You decide to use the full depth of the wardrobe here with the drawers, so you can see they do come out quite far. Plenty of storage for shoes, clothes. Again, the next carcass something similar, a standard rail, those extra deep drawers again, and your short rail at the back. Here you have your long hanging rail and your standard at the back again. So now I'm just going to show you the, the doors here in the final clip of the video. Here you have a full mirror, cream glass, cream glass and full mirror again. Obviously the choice of doors is optional as the same with the internal fit out. 
So for more information you can contact the website at swissforms.ie or visit the showrooms at Unit 106, the 6th Crossroads Business Park. So I say thanks for liking and sharing all the previous videos and photos we've uploaded. Uh, we do appreciate all the support, the reviews and the recommendations. So thanks again. So I mean, get liking and sharing please and we'll talk to you soon.